Coyotes hosting the Kings, and the Kings are minus 152 on the money line. The Coyotes are plus 126. The over-under is at 6.5 goals. The Kings laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 158, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two goals or more. And the Coyotes getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 192, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you'd win. They lose by one goal, you would win. These are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow. Thank you for everyone who has joined my Discord and who continues to join it. If you've not done so yet, go to my website, rawsportstalk.com. Click on the membership tab. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets and to my stats. It's supposed to be Talbot and Vegmelka, but neither of the goaltenders have been confirmed for tomorrow's game. They have played each other twice so far this season. Head-to-head, -head, the road team is 6-4. and four. The Kings are on a three-game winning streak. The Kings are 8-2 and two against the Coyotes in their last 10. The favorites on a three-game winning streak. The favorite is 6-4 and four on the money line. The underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 7-3. and three. There have been six one-goal games in their last 10 meetings, including the last game they played against each other. The over is hit in their last three. The over is 6-4. and four, And the over-under at 6.5 goals is 5-5. Five and five. The Kings won 6-3 in LA this year, and then the Kings won 5-4 out here in Arizona. Those are the two games they've played against each other this year. The Kings are 2-2 two two in their last four. The under is hit in, wow, it looks like six out of their last seven games. No, seven out of their last eight games. The under is 7-0-1 in their last eight games. They scored three goals and a loss in overtime, two goals and a loss, two goals and a win, and then five goals and a win. The under is 8-7 in the Kings games, and the over is 11-6 in the Coyotes games. The Coyotes are 2-2 two two in their last four. The over is 3-1 in their last four games. They scored seven goals and a win, three goals and an overtime loss, three goals and a win against the Blues, uh, the Blue Jackets, and then two goals and a loss. Two out of their last three games that they've played have been one-goal losses. I'm going to take the Kings with the money line. I'm going to take the Kings laying the goals, and I'm going over in this one. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.